All right, guys, today here at Drizza Auto, we have an R34 GTR sitting on these amazing, famous green floors. Have tons and tons of Nismo parts on it. This thing is amazing. Z Tune hood, fenders. Actually, this is a R hood. And the Nismo catalog. Titanium strut brace. We have the Nismo, uh, all the piping from the Nismo, air duct, R35 coil packs that's, that's hiding on the, under the covers here. Tons and tons of Nismo parts um, all around this vehicle. This car, I'm super excited to, to work on it. Uh, worked on 32s, 33s, 35s, but uh, I also did some house calls on these cars, but none of them were sitting on the green floor. Okay, let's take a look and see what this car has on it. Starting with the Z-Tune front bumper, Z-Tune fender, Nismo wheel, R35 brakes, Nismo side skirts. We have the Nismo swats, front and rear. I forgot to show you that in the front, but Nismo taillights carbon fiber wing. This is absolutely, absolutely an amazing car. I am so thankful that I get to work on these amazing cars every day. It's a dream job. All right, now that we have the car up in the air um, and getting ready to do all the fluid changes, let's take a quick walkthrough and see how immaculate this car is underneath. It looks like they just stripped this whole car down, pressure washed it, cleaned it, and did all the coatings back again. You could see where the car was on a rack, where that spot is, but everything else got fresh coating on top of it. And cradle and all of that was either refurbished or put a brand in brand new. I can't even tell how clean this thing is. Um, all of the subframe, the brackets and stuff that usually are cruddy looking and dirty, and you know, it, it's absolutely amazing. It looks like they're brand new stuff. They even put all the, um, the OEM pink markings back onto it on pinch wells. Usually these things come and they're all beat up and, and stuff like that. Pinch wells are absolutely great on both sides. No dents, no dings, no nothing on them. All of this looks like it's fresh, brand new, um, recoded. Look at the, the body. It is still nice and smooth. Nothing on it. No rust. Zero, zero rust on this car. Uh, it looks like it was done really really well fuel tank this looks like a new fuel tank to me it has no markings and this is great the oem tank looks like uh, i could tell that it was out because of the pin the marking on the pin but it is amazing. absolutely amazing like all of the nuts on the on the center brace and stuff like that as you can tell they're all brand new they're they were replaced. All of the undercarriage for the fuel lines and everything, all the bolts are brand new. Some of the grommets and stuff like that, they were all changed out. Yeah, all of that, these look like they were just refurbished. They changed the bushings out to Nismo bushings into them. Um, they cleaned them up. Still has the GTR. As I keep looking around underneath this car, I keep finding more and more upgraded parts. And here's a perfect example. It's got a four core Nismo intercooler in there. It is mostly common for us to find a three core intercooler on these things, which this is a really, really up, nice upgrade and a plus for it. Um, haven't driven it yet. I will drive it after I finish all the fluid changes and check it out. Thank you.
Okay, this aura looks really good. Someone dropped it out and changed it out. It, it is actually pretty clean. Normally we would drop these on a daily basis um, on all of these JDM cars and they're really, really dirty. Uh, people guess don't like to change diff oils and we see it so many times where it would damage the, the diffs and we would have issues with them. So this is a good, good thing that someone did. So the transmission fluid is drained and it's actually looking pretty decent. It's not bad. Um, it's got a little dark shade of red. Uh, it's been in there for a little while. But overall, there's no chips. There's nothing, zero metal on the magnet. So why are we using the red silicone and not the gray one, Derek? Because this is the OEM color silicone that they use uh, prior to the gray. After all the services is done, which included front diff, rear diff, transfer case, transmission, oil change, power steering, brake flush, clutch flush, coolant. Now we've got a startup. We're getting everything, make sure everything's good. We have no leaks. We're going to go ahead and lift it up and then check underneath on the undercarriage to make sure that we've got everything buttoned up. Acceleration is really nice. Power band is really, really nice on the stock twins. This car drives amazing. It, it feels like it just came out of the factory from like day one. Do you have some variant to like uh, R32, 3 or R35? 32s are a, lot, a little bit more lighter. So it feels a little bit more wobbly. This one feels like it's planted on the ground. It's on the road. It it feels really, really Brakes good. And tracks Tight. really well. Yeah, the well, the tracking and the braking on this car would feel amazing because of the R35 brakes that um, upgrade it has, and it, it literally is pretty pretty cool. I, I uh, I'm enjoying this. Really, really enjoying this. Uh, your excitement, I am excited. I am laughing on the inside. I'm, <laughs> I'm like, I don't know what they call it, giddy. Uh, all of the above. It is nice that we have a lot of roads out here where we are that's pretty good and uh, we don't have a ton, a ton of traffic. That, and we have some nice twisted roads. So it's definitely nice for us to feel the actual car, the way it, it, it rides. stops nice it really stops nice
All right, guys, this car was actually truly amazing to drive um, and work on. I'm thankful for the customers and clients to bring their vehicle and trust us to work on these things. Um, it, it is absolutely true blessing for it. I hope you guys enjoyed looking at all the details that went into this car. With that said, uh, thank you guys for watching. Rita and I do appreciate this. Uh, please like and subscribe. Um, share it with a friend. And definitely we'll catch you on the next one. Thank you.